with iPad OS 14, Apple brought us a really cool feature called Scribble. And Things 3, as with many things on the iPad, has done an excellent job supporting it. So today we're gonna to do a video on how to use Scribble in Things 3. Before we get there though, a couple ways you can support the channel. Number one is to go to patreon.com slash Curtis McHale, support the channel. Number two is to go to curtismchale.ca slash Skillshare. You can take my current course on Tick Tick. I have an upcoming course on time blocking and you're actually just about to watch a little bit of what will become my upcoming course on Things 3. Kind of, you know, workshopping the videos as I go, writing them, getting them all ready, putting some of them on YouTube. The rest will be out on Skillshare. Buckle up. All right, so Scribble for Things 3 is excellent. One of the best things you can do really if we take our pencil here is we can start writing anywhere. So we can write, this task. There you go. We have a new task, which is excellent. Now you can do this into really anywhere, right? Another task and we have another task there. We can do it in upcoming. We could do it in, right? I could say, let's look over here. Oh, I clicked someday by accident. So I, but I could go over here and say another thing, All right? And adds it to that day, All right? We can add it to even in our inbox or in my today view, right? I've got some projects here. I could say project task. And I'll go into that project, right? Or I could say another one. I'm not sure if it'll pick that one up, did it? Oh, Anokin one. Eh, you know, sort of close. Now, one thing I don't love about it is if I go up here and if I search, uh, if I go into my tags, and I'll just say this week. So I've got all this stuff this week. Now, what it doesn't let me do is anything in here. That's probably the biggest drawback to Scribble support on the iPad is it doesn't let me do anything there. Um, in your, like in a tag view, lets me do it say an upcoming, in any time, I can put a tag in here, right? I could put it in here. Another, that's not gonna work again. Short cut, right? That adds it to the shortcuts to build. Actually, it did pick up another, perfect. Um, Right, we can navigate the interface. I could even go in here and I could start typing a uh, project. So let's look up, uh, let's, I don't know, I'll try Matthew. Matthew, All right, and it found that project right in my quick search, which is excellent, right? I can scribble things out, delete it. So that's great. Really the only drawback that I have found with Scribble support in things three is that you can't add it into your tags, right? If I go, oh, even finding it maybe this week, if I go cut this week, I'll find it, look at that, did find it. And I can't put it into any of these tags. So this is entirely unaccessible to me. I can maybe do this, All right? Magic plus button won't work. I could add something to the inbox and then use Scribble, there you go. But, all right, I could use it, the magic plus button into a project. Project thing, look at that, I even picked it all up. That's great, but I can't. I can even come in here, edit the project, that works great, complete. But I can't access tags. So if I go again to this week, find the tag. No, see, I'll go back. So if I go my finger, I can go back, enter, no. So that's really it. That's kind of the big limitation of things three scribble support is that it doesn't allow you to enter tasks into the tag view. I haven't had any other views that are limited, but that's one. So that's it, thanks. If you wanna like the video, thumbs up below. If you loved it, then you go to YouTube and you hit that little, you know, bell thing and it may maybe let you know if something happened, but it's YouTube, so who knows. Uh, other ways to support the channel is to go to patreon.com slash Curtis McKill, support the channel, or to go to 
uh, chrismichael.ca slash Skillshare, where you can take my upcoming course on Things 3. You're actually kind of watching part of what will be part of it now. Uh, or you can take my upcoming course on time blocking, or you can take my current course on TickTick. Have an excellent day.